My mother was an alcoholic and a drug addict. She um, attracted a lot of different guys into the house. It's really, really weird to be eight years old and to know that where you're living at the time is not safe. It's a, it's a realization that I don't think any eight-year-old is supposed to have, but it's one that I had. We were growing up in an environment that was completely surrounded with um, drugs, sex, violence, um, alcohol. When I went to go with my father, things improved, you know, physically and financially. I had a place to sleep, you know, consistently. I had a home that I always knew was going to be there. Um, but there was a lot of leftover anger that at the time I didn't understand. I didn't know why it was there. My dad realized, you know, after, you know, watching me lash out at school and him just not being able to get through to me that I needed more help than he could give me. And that was a very hard realization for him. He told me that he loved me and he said, I don't think that you're broken, um, but I think that something is broken and that we don't have the tools to fix it. And so I want to send you somewhere, to send you to people who do.